In Uganda, 85% of working women are employed in the informal economy, but many lack access to reliable childcare at their places of work. Despite some newer markets having childcare spaces, they are often underused or rented out for other businesses. A new World Bank study reveals that only 22% of women entrepreneurs interviewed in Wakiso and Kampala have access to formal childcare services. The report identifies several barriers, including affordability, accessibility, quality of services, and lack of trust among service providers. The study also found that 22% of women rely on family, friends, or neighbors for childcare, while 56% are left with no choice but to either work with their children or leave them at home alone. Speaking at a high-level policy dialogue in Kampala, Minister of Gender, Labor and Social Development, Betty Amongi emphasized that the lack of affordable childcare directly affects women's productivity. Already, the report is saying 56 of women do not have the daycare facilities for their children, which means if they do not have those care, their children will be in unsafe area and most times instead of using 12 hours to do business it will reduce maybe to four hours or only six hours doing business because some of the times will have to be uh, distributed to go back home to care for the child uh, or to, to look for other people who will care and it will also affect their business that you have now to look for other people who can care for your children. And when you are not settled about the safety of your child, you cannot do any work meaningfully. Minister Mongi also announced that the government has allocated funds to establish these facilities. We will be able to go into major markets and business areas where women are concentrated and we shall establish some of these basic daycare facility and put in place equipment where they can have the milk of the baby uh, stored and some nursing uh, uh, nursing personnel that can support in looking after their children while they are doing the work. A law to enforce their creation is also in the works. And if we want to facilitate their businesses, we must have a framework which supports care for their children so that they are able to undertake their businesses without worrying about the safety of their children. With these initiatives, the government aims to break down the barriers holding back female entrepreneurs, creating a more supportive environment for women in business across Uganda. Benjamin Jumbe, NTV Weekend Edition.